Hi, I'm Peter Kalmstrom of Kalmstrom.com Business Solutions. In this demonstration, I'll show you how to set up your Outlook client so that it works with your Office 365 Exchange Outlook client, so to speak, your Office Web Access. It has many, many names, but the mail client that's included in your Office 365. If you want the uh, client installed version of Outlook, or if you already have that, I'm going to show you how to set it up to communicate so you can send email from and receive email to and manage your calendar and all that. So the first thing is, of course, to set up your computer to connect to the Office 365 account. You do that on the start menu, on the settings here, and under accounts, and here under access work or school, you connect to your work or school account. I've already done that here, but the principle is very simple. You simply click connect and then log in with your work or school account. Set that up and then just go through the wizard. So now it's already connected. So that means that Windows handles your login information to Office 365. That makes the whole process very, very simple. So now you simply have to start Outlook. First time I'm doing this now. And uh, then you get this wizard. Just click next. Do you want Outlook to connect an email account? Next. And here it's already filled that out. So the only thing I need to do is fill in the password. There we go. And just click next. Now it's um, you know, searching for the settings and um, logging into the mail server eventually. There we go. We get the little checkbox there. It's all done. And finish. So now I can start my Outlook. I get a little commercial for the Outlook on the phone there. I won't do the, that now, but I'll go through and open Outlook 2016 now after I've set that up. And here you go. I get what's new. Very friendly. Thanks. Close. Setting up a local copy and downloading my email. And as you see, I get my calendar. I get my contacts and all the usual stuff there. To change any of the settings, for that profile now, the profile that I have in Outlook that's connecting to my Office 365 account, I go into the file and look at the Office account. There we go. So now you see, I see that I'm connected to that, uh, that service. Also on the Info tab here, I have the account settings. And here I can see the account setting that gets you into the profile settings there. One of the things that you might want to change, it's the cached exchange mode. Change that here. Then you'll see that by default, it's downloading 12 months of your uh, email. You might want to change that. You probably want to have it. You don't want to disable that. That will hurt your performance quite a bit if you don't use exchange cached mode. So keeping the default there might be a good idea. Or if you really want to use all of your email, you can do that too, of course. I'll just cancel that now. So that's it. That's how you set up your local Outlook client to work with your Office 365 mail. Thank you for watching this demonstration.